This is induction lamp. Induction lamp is an electrodeless lamp. There, there is no electrode. This is 120 watt and this is 40 watt lamp. We achieve very low cost electronic ballast for this induction lamp. See this uh, only few component. This is the AC input and this is going to the lamp. So this is a MOSFET based electronic circuit that uh, working frequency is 250 kilohertz and this is the inductor and this is the driver IC then it's the capacitor and we are making AC to DC and here we are making the high frequency high voltage then uh, starting of the lamp uh, 250 kilohertz uh, above 1000 volt is required after that the voltage we are uh, uh, reducing uh, that entire thing we achieved in a very very less component and one tricky method that other in the market all this induction lamp circuit is so complex and that's why it is not uh, coming very popular in the market this is a very low cost circuit in the induction lamp Uh, this is the high frequency generator. I am going to show the theory behind this uh, induction lamp. Okay, uh, this this will produce uh, this will produce uh, electro here high frequency radio waves. Then if I close this lamp to this, see you can see the lamp is lighting. See like this. See like this. Then, like this, you can see. Yeah, yeah, I'll take it. So, there is no wire connection. I'll take it. There is no wire connection is required. Let this lamp, as soon as I get the lamp, the lamp. We are coming closer. This, this is due to the friction. But the theory behind now use a uh, one radiating antenna. Then in that electromagnetic radiated and it uh, it lighted that lamp. But the theory behind in this uh, uh, same kind. But in this this toroid having the winding. Then uh, the we are applying high frequency here so this will act like a secondary that is like this means you can see this toroid this is a short circuited secondary and here so many number of times and if here I am applying in this I am applying high frequency then this current will flow in this like a secondary so this is the gas in this lamp this is a wire so this current secondary short circuited secondary the current will flow in this lamp this toroid is this toroid and this wire is this lamp so if I am applying that high frequency here the secondary current will flow that will light the lamp so we don't want any electrode in this I'm going to connect this ballast to the lamp now I connected the lamp. See the lamp I connected. This is the AC 230 volt. Then this I connected to the lamp. Now I switch on. The lamp is lighting. See that uh, 230. Then this is that high frequency we are applying through this. Then uh, that without any wire electrode, without any electrode, this lamp is lighting. Very small circuit you can see. With this we achieved this. Very very small circuit and very less component.